So what do you think Amy would make of us tonight? What did what? What do you think Amy would make of us tonight? Well, I've only just arrived, so I don't know. No, but as an event for the, for the foundation. Um, well, obviously, I think everyone can see that there's a good turnout. Um, the support is big and exciting. I don't know, I've not even seen anything other than that of those photographers. It's a weird question. <laughs> I think, like, you know, obviously she was evidence of how important it actually was. And, um, you know, she was a public figure, and it's kind of so tragic that what happened to her. But, you know, the, the con these kind of outcomes happen, like, all the time with young people who aren't in the public eye. And I just think, like, it's really important that, like, you know, with the kind of pull of the attention of the media that she had as a person, that, that it turns into something positive. And I think that her family and she would have wanted that to happen. So I'm happy to be here to support her. What's your favourite Amy song and what it means to you? I think Love is a Losing Game. Well, it's a bit emotional thinking about it. Um, it's like a genius piece of songwriting and sort of um, I totally empathise with her sentiment it's pretty hard out there for everyone isn't it emotionally so um, that one it's, it's quite difficult but is it possible to think of one favourite memory that you have of Amy one particular incident or sort of time together um, I only met her once and um, she was like she was like really sort of ballsy like me but I was like kind of shocked there was somebody else like that <laughs> she was like hello I was like alright it was just like Whoo. and then um, I don't know I just remember being struck by like how charismatic she was and um, definitely not somebody you could forget thank you